Active Campaign GDPR. GDPR is the general data protection regulation that goes into effect on May 25th, 2018. Active Campaign has updates at that link, and then the third link there, the last link there, is an automation I've created to identify contacts that are from EU countries. So the motivation here is that there's more regulation uh, coming into play, and I simply want to be able to identify people that are from EU nations. Now, I'm not giving legal advice. All I'm doing is providing automation I use to identify people from EU countries. So I'm going to use this site here and pick off all these countries. I believe there's 28 at this time. That could change over time, I'm speculating. So the automation I've set up handles that type of scenario. And the way it works is this. I've created an automation called GDPR, and I'm going to tag anybody that's from an EU country with a tag called profile-eu. Now, there are some limitations on how many countries you can look up, but we can get around that. So the way this automation works is it doesn't matter how somebody gets put in here. Typically, I put somebody in here from other automations. You could have it based on signing up to a list or to a form or purchasing a product or behavior whatever. But my first step is simply to remove the tag because I could envision a scenario where sometime in the future a country that's on this list goes off of this list. And then you want to do a bunch of if-else conditions. Now the reason there's multiple if-elses is because there's a limit of 20 conditions that you can check at any one time. So I had to break it up. So 20 here and 8 here. Anybody that meets any of these requirements, in other words goes down the yes path, is going to get tagged with the profile EU. Anybody that goes down the no path is just going to simply go to the end. So the way this setup looks like, the if-else condition, is simply looking for the country, is, and then all of the different EU countries. And notice I'm using the or, not the and. You need to use the or condition. So there's the first 20. And so, for instance, if someone doesn't meet this, they can still meet one of these countries. In this case, there's only eight. And again, it's all or conditions. So when everything's said and done, I can run, I can run all my contacts through here and simply identify people that are from EU countries. So that's what I've got for Active Campaign GDPR.